Is your pool still green? Even after dumping in chlorine, you shock it, wait, and it's still swampy? Let me show you the real fix that actually works so you can stop throwing away money and get back to swimming. There's one specific reason your chlorine isn't working. And once you know it, you'll never waste money on extra chemicals again. Here's the truth. The reason your pool stays green isn't that you need more chlorine, it's that your pH is wrong. When your pH is above 7.8, chlorine becomes almost useless. At pH 8 ppm, chlorine is only 20% effective. At pH 8.5 ppm, just 10% effective. So even if you dump in a gallon of chlorine, you're only getting the power of a few ounces. Here's your fix. Test your pH, it should be between 7.2 and 7.6 ppm. If it's higher, add a pH decreaser. For every 0.2 you need to drop, add one pound of pH decreaser per 10,000 gallons. Wait two hours, then retest. Once your pH is in range, add your chlorine shock. Use one pound of calcium hypochlorite shock per 10,000 gallons for light green, two pounds for dark green, but always check the instructions. I've dropped links in the description for pH reducer and shock, so you can see what you need and get it delivered right to your door. But wait, there's one more thing that can turn your pool green, even if your pH and chlorine are perfect. Most pool stores won't tell you about this, but it's the hidden culprit behind stubborn green water. The secret enemy, phosphates. They come from fertilizer, leaves, and even some pool chemicals. Phosphates feed algae, making it nearly impossible to clear your water, even if your chemistry is perfect. If you keep fighting green water, get a phosphate test kit, anything above 500 parts per billion, treat it with a phosphate remover. I've linked a phosphate remover below. If this helped you, smash the like button so more pool owners can find this fix. And comment how long you've been fighting your green pool.